In this video, I'll be guiding us step by step through the process of natively installing GeForce Now on SteamOS with the Steam Deck. This will allow us to stream and enjoy our Steam, Epic Games, and PC Game Pass libraries using either the free tier of Access or with a paid membership, which provides us with an NVIDIA RTX 4080 graphics card, and with this, we can run our games at their highest settings and get the best possible performance. The first thing we want to do with our SteamOS device powered on and in gaming mode is press the Steam button, go down to power, and then switch to desktop mode. From desktop mode, we want to access our web browser and we want to come over to nvidia.com GeForce Now download. On this page, we want to scroll down to a section called Gaming Handheld Devices and we want to choose Download on Steam Deck. Select Download and we want to make sure that this GeForce Now setup.bin we download to our Downloads folder and press Save. Afterwards, let's open our Downloads folder. We want to run the GeForce Now setup.bin in our Downloads folder just by simply double tapping R2. And then we want to press Continue and wait for the installation process to begin. And after around two to three minutes, the installation of GeForce Now will complete and we now need to close this window and then close this window and return to gaming mode. Once we're back in gaming mode, let's press the Steam button, go down to Library and in our non-Steam section, we want to select NVIDIA GeForce Now and then simply go ahead and press Play. When the app launches, we'll have full control of the D-pad and we can go down and select Continue and when we log in for the first time, we will have to visit the link shown on screen and then we will need to visit that site on our phone or a computer where we're already logged in to GeForce Now, entering the code shown afterwards. And once the code has been entered, we'll be able to log in to GeForce Now on the Steam Deck. We can link our Steam, Epic Games and Game Pass accounts to the GeForce Now app, but we can only do this on another computer through the web browser. So once you've done all that, you'll have all of your accounts linked and you can fire up any game in your library as long as you're on the correct membership. And when I load into Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, you can see I'm on the Extreme Graphics preset, Nvidia DLSS automatically, and everything else is on pretty much the maximum settings. And we can see I'm playing Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 online through GeForce Now on the Steam Deck within SteamOS with no issues depending on your internet connection your experience may vary and when we finish with a game and back on our home screen we can navigate to the top bar and go to the three lines in the top left hand corner and we can go on our settings and here we can check our account and connections alongside settings that affect our gameplay such as streaming quality resolution upscaling, etc. And we have the system section and about section. So I recommend going through all of these settings and familiarizing ourselves with each of them. If you enjoyed this video and learned something new today, please give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment and share this video with others. And until next time, have a wonderful day. Look out for one another and I'll see you later.